I came out here because I've been wanting to make something like this for a while now, uh, partly for people that I know watch these videos, my friends and other people. I think there's like three people that aren't my friends that watch my videos. Um, and probably for myself, just as kind of uh, something that I would write for myself and for myself, for no one else to see. But I figured, hey, if it's good enough for me, it's good enough for everybody else, right? I really should have worn some bug spray. Um... Is everything going to be okay? Is it? Everything will be alright? Yeah. I'll get that off the bat. I mean, you already saw the title of the video. Everything's going to be alright. Um, that's something that you kind of got to have. I mean, you can hear me say and be like, yeah, okay, but why? Um, I don't really have a reason why it's all going to be alright. It just has to be you know it can't not be all right it has to be all right and you got to think about what being all right but okay like what that actually means like you could lose everything would you still be okay if you lost everything i really should have worn some bug spray get away i'm doing a video stop it will it all be okay yeah it has to be and if you think, well, everything's not okay right now, it'll it'll even out. Things will eventually be okay. There's a lot of, uh, whatever the opposite of a zoomer is, a doomer. Everyone's like, yeah, once you get past 30, everything goes downhill. Things never get better. Things only get worse. Really? Really? Is that really true? Or are you just miserable? Did you just fuck up your life? And now you don't have the balls to change anything about your life? Is that why your life? Is that why your life sucks? Cause I mean, no one else put you in your life beside you. I mean, it's, it's up to you. And that's something you gotta remember too. Is that, it's your. Oh my God, it's it's your life. I mean, there are a lot of things about the world and the things at large that you read on the internet, and you're like, oh, I have no, I can't do anything about any of that. Yeah, you can't. So don't. Don't try to do that. Try and think about the things that, like, genuinely that you can do and the things you can change and the things you want to change. Because it is, you are the one in control of your life. And yeah, there are things you can't change about your life. If you've got a shitty boss, if you've got a shitty job and you can't leave because, for whatever reason. Because that happens. That does happen. There are things in your life that are out of your control, but you got to figure out the steps to take to put you in control. And then you don't have to control it anymore. And when you think to yourself, I can't do anything, I'm all fucked up. Yeah, of course you're fucked up. Everybody's fucked up. And some people are way more fucked up than others. And some people aren't as fucked up as others. But... That's okay. Even the the most perfect people. No there's no there's no shortage of amazing people that do tremendous things and then people talking about how they're actually awful and criticizing them for whatever menial thing they can find. Those are miserable people. And being miserable isn't good for anybody, especially for you. Because whenever you're miserable, the whole world, your whole outlook is miserable. And then all of a sudden, the world is a much worse place to be in. And that doesn't mean to be a naive, happy-go-lucky, hippie fella. Because you've got to be real about things. Things can, will get shitty. Things in your life will come out of your control. And the powers that control your life, certain aspects of your life, will fuck you over. But that's not a problem. You're a bad motherfucker. What? <laughs> You, you can't you can't just not deal with that. Take action. Change some things in your life to give you a little bit more wiggle room so you can really be you. Don't let you just get all pent up in a... I mean, I don't think people even do office jobs anymore because they're so memed on now at this point. But, like, come on now. Don't, don't take it lying down. Take control of your life. You can do it. I mean, it's fucking hard and it's scary and it's not easy in the slightest. But you don't change your life overnight, you know? It's a slow rush. But you can do that, too. I mean, you made it this fucking far. 
if you're my age, think, look back on what you used to do in fucking middle school. Think about that for a second, huh? Think about how much shit you didn't know in middle school. And that you still somehow was in the most, survived in the most crazy social climate. In the most crazy social settings I think you could fucking put a human being in. Think about high school. You literally learned how to read when you were a kid. You learned how to fucking understand language. And if you're a pro, maybe you even learned two languages. What the fuck? I don't even know how people do that. That's insanity. That you can learn two languages. So yeah, you did that. What what else can you not do? You learned, a, learned how to understand written and spoken language. You can communicate with other people. That's insane. But you did that. If you can speak English. So, yeah, everything's going to be all right. What? There really isn't anything you can't do. Stop it. I'm doing an earnest video for once. Cut the shit. And yeah, what if, hypothetically, let's say, the old Joey Biden, you know, gets sniped off by the Russians, World War Three outbreaks. What's going to happen? I don't fucking know. It'll be all right. Because it'll always be all right. Look at what's around me, huh? Even if the whole human race dies off, this will still be here. Eventually, it'll be a desert for millions of years, but things will recover. Things always recover, especially this goddamn planet. The whole place was a goddamn snow globe, and it's still here. Meteor strikes, still here. It'll be all right. And yeah, I mean, I say that, and I still get anxious like every other day. I remember, I think to myself, yeah, I really could take my life. Not that I want to. No reason to be concerned. I don't want to. But that's a real thing I can do. And that's a real thing everybody can do. No one should. No one should have to think about it that often with actual earnest and intention. But we can all do that. Don't. And if you want to, talk to your friend... But I'm done. I don't like people pretending like it's this taboo thing. Everybody can do it. And no one, no, everyone's pretending like it isn't a thing. We can all hurt people. We all have that capacity to do that. You can destroy someone's life if you chose to. But we don't. So things are okay. Things, I mean, I hate saying things could be a lot worse because that's kind of a slap in the face that people that have it way worse than I do and way worse than a majority of the population does, but things will be okay. Things might not get better very quickly. They might get worse before they get better because that's what happens. Things come in waves like that, you know? But it'll be all right. I'm fucked up. You're fucked up. We're all fucked up. The whole goddamn place is fucked up. The game is fucked up. The country's fucked up. School's fucked up. A lot of things are fucked up. But you're still here. You're still doing shit. I don't know how you're doing it. And it's okay that you're fucked up. If you knew better, you would be doing better. How are you supposed to know? How are you supposed to know? No one told you. And if they did and you didn't listen, that's on you, buddy. I can't plead here and say, oh, how was I supposed to know that spray painting a building wouldn't get me arrested? How was I? I should have known, and I did know. But now I know. Now I really know. And not in the way that you have to recall the thing that's stuck in you. So it'll be all right. And that doesn't mean to stop worrying and to stop being skeptic and stop looking for things that are wrong and trying to figure out what to do. Keep doing that. That's like the best part about you is that you do know that things are wrong. Things aren't perfect. They'll never be perfect. Because that's the way that things work. If things are free, things can't be perfect. Because we're not perfect. And you'll never be perfect. But goddamn, you can be good. Do you want to be comfortable? 
Do you want to be unstoppable? Do you want to be a pillar of strength to people around you? Jesus God, it flew right in my ear. Because you can. You can be all those things. But will you? I don't know. I want to be. I try to be. That's up to you. The thing is, you can do it. So, yeah. It'll be all right.